Hi everyone, my name is Elizabeth and if you're new here, welcome. So Mondays are grocery shopping days for me and that's today. So I only have one small grocery haul for you. I got all of this stuff back here from Kroger and I'm gonna go over it all with you, but um, this week is a little different. I'm only making dinner four days this week and so I didn't need a ton of stuff, but let's get into it and see everything I got. So let's start over here with the cold stuff. So. The first thing I got back here is a three pound bag, maybe. No, I'm sorry, 3.7 pound bag of the Tyson chicken patties. Those are just gonna be for lunches or a really quick dinner. The next thing I picked up was a pound of Italian sausage. So I have um, one in my refrigerator already, but I'm gonna be making lasagna and I'm gonna be doing two big pans of lasagna. So I needed another pound of that. So I got another one. Next here, I got just, these are just chicken breasts and I want grilled chicken for dinner one night this week. So we're gonna grill that. Um, it's very beautiful where I live. It's today was an 80, 80 something degree day. It was just, it was awesome. So. I'm in the mood for grilled food for sure. Back here, I got two bags of this Italian style shredded cheese. Those are for the lasagnas that I'm gonna be making. I got a big tub here of ricotta cheese. Again, that's also for the lasagna. I wanted to get a head of, oh, I'm choking on something. I don't know, excuse me. Wanted to get a head of lettuce. I, I don't really have anything that I need it for. Um, I did get a big bag of salad here, but I thought that that would be good too in case I want them for wraps or um, on sandwiches or if I wanted to make another salad if we run out of this bag. So obviously since I just talked about that, there is a big bag of salad and then I got um, several grapes. So if you've watched many of my grocery hauls, you're going to notice that I don't have bananas this week. I was going to get some, but we actually have several still left and I decided to just skip it this week, which I rarely do. But anyway, next here I got a five pound bag of potatoes. I plan to make potato salad with the grilled chicken and so I needed those. Here I got some buns. Those are for the chicken patties. And um, if we have burgers or something like that this week, I will, I'll, we'll just use those for that too. I very rarely run out of ramen noodles, but I don't currently have any. And my son and daughter both, this is just a super easy lunch for them sometimes. And um, I wanted to go ahead and just get this 12 pack just to have some in the house again. Here are two packs of oven-ready lasagna noodles. These are for the lasagnas I'll be making, and I needed those. I like the oven-ready ones. I think that they just make it obviously even easier, and if I can take a little shortcut every now and then, I definitely don't mind taking a shortcut. <laughs> Here is mayonnaise. So I have a squeeze bottle of mayonnaise, but I wanted to go ahead and get this bigger one for um, making the potato salad and things like that. It's just, I don't know, I figured I would get some because if not, it probably would have taken the whole squeeze bottle of the mayonnaise I had and I need that for other things. So back here, I picked up just a bag of tortilla chips. My son likes nachos a lot and chips and salsa and um, we were out or getting close to being out of tortilla chips. So I knew he would need some of those this week. I picked up four of these Barilla pasta sauces. So I got two traditionals and two of the tomato basil. I like this sauce. I do doctor it up with um, other spices. I add Italian seasoning and garlic and onions sometimes. Um, and I just kind of adjust the seasoning a little bit more to our tastes. But I do like this one because it's no sugar added. I know a lot of pasta sauces are going in that direction, but these are what I'm actually gonna use for the lasagnas. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, just use these as the uh, base for the sauce for the, the lasagnas. Um, I'm making, a, like I said, two big pans of lasagna for um, a large group of people. And um, so yeah, I just wanted to go ahead. I'll use all four of those for those lasagnas. Next thing I picked up here, the the checkout got me and I got two Reese's. These are just for me. 
I wanted a little treat after dinner. Next, I picked up these granola bars. If this is not your first video, you know that my daughter is a granola bar fanatic. I think I said that last time, but she really is. She loves eating these for breakfast and I got her those. I picked up some raisins. My son likes raisins and my daughter does too. And I thought that these would just be a quick little, you know, grab and go snack that I could either put in my purse um, that they could, you know, in case we were out, they would just have a little snack or uh, my daughter could put some in her stuff or whatever. So just easy little snack. Here I got two of these hand soaps. It's just the Kroger equivalent to the gold dial hand soap. Um, it was on sale this week and it was cheaper and I just needed some soap. So I picked up those two. Back here, I did get a 24 pack of the Kroger purified water. Again, most of the time, if I'm trying to save a little bit of money, I'll just go ahead and get the purified water. I do like, um, like the natural spring water better for sure. Um, I couldn't find the Kroger brand spring water. So I just got this today just to save a few dollars. It was I didn't have to, but I thought, why not? Try to keep everything as cheap as possible. And the only other thing that is not here, it's actually in our garage refrigerator, is I got four cases of LaCroix. I always get those. Um, and yeah, so I got those. And this today, my total here at Kroger was $116. Um, I Like I said, this is going to be kind of a Definitely a light week for us because I am still kind of working with some of the stuff in my freezer, but also I just didn't need a lot. So that's everything. And I appreciate you watching and stick around because next week we're probably due for a pretty sizable grocery haul. So I'll probably have a big one next week. So I'll see you next time. Bye.